Our viewer Lillian saves 3869 bucks in fees and add-ons using the Homework Guys free resources and abbreviated FTC regs that we have on our website. Yeah. Hi, I'm Kevin Hunter, the Homework Guy, here today with Amazing Elizabeth, the Homework Gal. Lillian is just so cute and sweet. When you meet her, you'll agree that she's an unlikely candidate for shutting down every move a car salesman and a finance officer attempt to pull on her. Ladies especially, check out her calm, cool confidence. Before we share Lillian's testimonial, let me give you a couple of things to watch out for. Lillian followed our suggestion on our free car buyer's guide to get pre-approved from her own credit union. In fact, she was so savvy that since she was a member of two different credit unions, she shopped them against each yeah. other too. Besides seeing this video, I also spoke to Lillian by phone beforehand and I recall her telling me that the finance man said, everybody pays the fees. And she responded with Liz's favorite comeback to that. I am not everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Bingo. Now, I don't mean to oversell what Lillian has to share, but I want every one of you to keep something in mind when you're watching her. If sweet Lillian can do it, so can you. Some of you actually commented after seeing Elizabeth's recent role play video with a finance officer that only Liz could do this. She's a professional. Well, let me tell you something I know about Lillian. She's a fantastic student. She found a great teacher here at The Homework Guy, and she went after it on her own. Yes, Lillian actually turned on offers for help from both her husband and her son because they thought that someone should go with her, but she confidently handled this on her own. She said, nope, I've got THG's resources. I'm good to go. Here is sweet Lillian, friends. Hello, everyone. My name is Lillian. I'm going to show you how I use the Homework Guy resources to get a good deal on my new car, Lexus NX350 F-Sport. And I did it all by myself using the Homework Guy resources. <laughs> so you too can do it. You okay. too. So the first thing I did was to check on my credit report using the three credit bureaus. This is free once a year. And then the second thing is I'm a member of two different credit unions. Northside Credit Union offered by my job and LGE Credit Union. So I compared the interest rate between these two banks to see which one has a better option. And the one offered by my job was the better one. So I put down my application and within two days I was approved and I qualified for their lowest interest rate, which was 2.5 which was still Great. better Boom. than the dealer overall. So credit union is the best option to go with. So after that, I printed out the homework guy suggested OTD email template for a new car. Love <laughs> it. And this is from their website. Yeah. <laughs> you can see. And I use it to draft email. And I sent this email to six different dealers that had the car that I was shopping for. Not surprising, two out of the six dealers I emailed, only two responded via email. Right. The rest of them wanted me to go to their office or discuss my questions over the phone. But my answer was just a simple no. Respond via email, then we can do the business. <laughs> and I left it at that. Now I worked with these two that responded via email. One of them had the car, but his prices were just way too much. And he would not back down on those fees or extended <laughs> warranties or nothing. He would not back out. I said bye-bye and left him alone. Yeah. Now focused on this last one. And him, he did not have the car on his lot. So I had to pay a thousand dollar deposit um, to guarantee the car. So he said the car was Dealer going trade. to be available in seven days. During that time, I asked the salesman to send me the bill of sale and specs of the car. So I know upfront all the fake fees and all the add-ons that I was not interested in. <laughs> he did awesome. just that. Then the big day came. Yeah. On that big day, I printed car dealer fake fees from the Homework Guy website. I also printed abbreviated Federal Trade Commission from the Homework Guy website. Go Lillian. And I 
read it i read all of it and highlighted the ones that i was going to talk about in case the dealer caused any issues or problems this is what you got to do guys you can read it I highlight highlighted, it i highlighted them and i highlighted all these up front good for the big day and read all of it before this is so day. killer good yeah for the big day and that day i took these documents with me and met the salesman now he already sent me the bill of sale with all the pricing and all that so then he tried to sell me the products again like extended warranty so many things on extended warranty warranty and i just said no because i was not interested i've done my homework i did not want any of those things yeah he also asked me how i was going to make my payment and i told him that i was already approved by my a credit union and i am happy with what they approved me with and i'm not interested in my credit being rammed again because but he was like well we want to match what credit union offered you and i just said no do not do it <laughs> i'm happy with what they offered me and i left it at that then he stopped and um the finance the finance guy came to introduce himself this is called a turnover tried to persuade me to buy these things but again my answer was no my no was no so he took me to his office more persuasions, <laughs> persuasions more persuasions to buy these things and i said no again and i asked him if he was familiar with the ftc rights <laughs> and he was like yes what about it and I just told him I was going to report him if he doesn't stop asking me about these things that I've already <laughs> talked about and I've said no to. So he started working on Love it. the paperwork on the computer. And every time he printed it out, there was an error. <laughs> so guys, make sure you look at your contract. Look wow. at it over and over. You will find an error. If you don't, you will buy that stuff. And yes, you will. It's not good for you. So... It's not good for your money. Just take your time, look at it, and you will find errors. Also, any add-on that is being sold to you has a contract. Look at the fine print down there, and you will see it. You're not obligated to buy any of those products. Totally. Tell them you're not interested and mention that. They will listen to you because that's what I did, and did not buy anything that I did not want the extended warranty, the gap insurance, all that. I did not buy any of that. And when I pulled out the FTC, guys, that was the end of the story. Yeah. There was no more persuasion, no more questions asked. And I cannot stress enough, the homework guy resources are genuine. They are true research and they work use those resources they're out there for free no charge free so elizabeth and kevin i want to thank you so much for all you do because this information helped me get a good deal on my car now i put down 19 percent plus the a thousand dollar way to go I put up front and financed with my credit union 36 months with a 2.5 interest rate. I was a happy buyer. Yeah. I was satisfied, signed my contract, took my car home. Anybody out there looking for cars, guys, do your homework. Use the homework guide resources and speak their language. Don't be afraid. <laughs> you will be the winner. You will get your dream car. I wish you good luck and I hope you are you get the good deal out there okay guys bye for now thank you you go girl lillian she saved herself three thousand eight hundred sixty nine dollars in fees and add-ons i'm so impressed and proud of you i couldn't have done it better myself 
we will text you and ask you for your mailing address. We have a special gift that we want to send you. And thank you so much for sharing your testimonial again. To all of our viewers out there, we'd love to hear your stories too. Indeed. Mm -hmm. Just like Lillian did, you can email us a short video testimonial to kevinthehomeworkguy at gmail.com. You likely have to send it as a Google Drive file because it will be bigger than 25 megabytes. As all of you heard Lillian say, all of the resources that she used were free on our website. The Car Buyer's Guide, which instructed her to get a pre-approval at her credit union, is there, along with the list of fake fees, the out-the-door email templates, and the abbreviated FTC regs that she used as well. They're there too. Totally. She put the right amount of money down and got a smoking good interest rate from her credit union. I also want to quickly remind our viewers that we'll provide free black book values for a vehicle you're shopping for or for the vehicle you'd like to trade in. You can text us 701-441-3399 or email kevinthehomeworkguy at gmail.com and you'll get an immediate auto response email with a roadmap to a successful car deal. If you're out walking the car lots right now, make sure you see Kevin's playlist, THG's Savvy Car Buyer's Homework Cram Session. Join the thousands of people who have already done that and do not forget to access all the free resources on our website thehomeworkguide.com. All right, if you're new here to the Homework Guide channel, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell so you get the notifications. Join the fast-growing group of subscribers we have here and become a part of our family. Thanks, everyone, for coming back. And to all of our faithful subs out there, you guys rock. God bless you all. I'm Kevin Hunter, the Homework Guy, signing off with Amazing Elizabeth, the Homework Gal. The Homework Guy team is serving truth and justice in the car business. We, we gotta, gotta go. go.